may not know that every night before the taping, I come out here and answer any question the audience asks me. Unless they ask me about that night up at the lake. <laughs> there are some things that are best left buried. <laughs> anyway, here's a look. You right there. Yeah. That's great. Yes. Do you have any advice as a father? Uh, yeah, a great name. Um, <laughs> as a father, as a parent, uh, uh, get a uh, uh, first first child. Yes. Get some sleep. <laughs> Not joking. Ha 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 ha. Get some sleep. Uh, go see some movies in a movie theater. You won't do that for many years. Um, uh, oh, when the baby's asleep, you go to sleep. Don't go like, oh, the baby's asleep, I'll clean up, or I'll get some emails. F that. Go to sleep <laughs> when the baby goes to sleep. This is what our pediatrician said to us. This is what our, our pediatrician said, said to us. And we said, no, we understand, sure, go to sleep. He goes, no, no, I am serious. Go to sleep. And I will tell you, and this is what he says. He goes, I was here, my wife was there. And he goes, I am Joseph Stalin. <laughs> I said, what? In this scenario, I'm Joseph Stalin. <laughs> I'm Joseph Stalin, and I want to destroy you because I think you're dangerous to me. But I can't destroy you because you're one of the heroes of the revolution. However, your wife over here is not a hero of the revolution. All I have to do is keep her awake for three days, and she will sign any piece of paper <laughs> that says that you are a, a traitor to the revolution, and now I can have both of you killed. Your baby is Joseph Stalin. <laughs> your baby will keep you up and you will betray each other, even though you don't mean it because you've lost your mind because you haven't slept. So keep in mind, your baby is Joseph Stalin. <laughs> Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Yes, sir. Uh, I'm here tonight uh, celebrating my 10-year anniversary with my wife. Oh, congratulations to you. <laughs> sure, stand up. I am actually a licensed minister in New York State. I'm of the, the of like the Church Universal no. and Triumphant or something like that. What is that? Is that Golem? <laughs> you have a little statue of Golem. <laughs> if only. That's lovely. But if only there was some prop in that story that you could use in a wedding. Only there was something that would uh, you could use in that way. Okay, so uh, so what's your name, buddy? Uh, Matt. What's your name, young lady? Autumn. Autumn? That's a beautiful name. Oh, hers won't come off. <laughs> Leave, okay, ready? Okay, so uh, hey, Matt, Matt, do you take Autumn to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Uh, Autumn, do you take Matt to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Do do you promise to put up with each other? And apologize even when it's not your fault. <laughs> do you? Yeah. Okay. That because that's the most important thing. Uh, always kiss before you go to bed. <laughs> right now you can kiss right now. <laughs> you should kiss better than that before you go to bed. But that's all right. <laughs> I now pronounce you continually married. <laughs> all right. Okay. We'll be right back, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> 